Hello and welcome to the session. I am Deepika here. Let's discuss a question which says A spherical glass vessel has a cylindrical neck 8 cm long, 2 cm in diameter. The diameter of the spherical part is 8.5 cm. By measuring the amount of water it holds, a child finds its volume to be 345 cm cube. Check whether she is correct. Taking the above as the inside measurements and pi is equal to 3.14. Now we know that volume of cylinder is equal to pi r square h where r is the radius of the base of the cylinder and h is the height of the cylinder. And volume of sphere is equal to 4 by 3 pi r cube where r is the radius of the sphere. So this is a key idea behind our question. We will take the help of this key idea to solve the above question. So let's start the solution. Now we are given a spherical glass vessel which has a cylindrical neck 8 cm long. So this is 8 cm long. And it is 2 cm in diameter. So, this is 2 cm. Now, we are given the diameter of the cylindrical part. Which is equal to 2 cm. Therefore, radius of the cylindrical part is equal to 1 centimeter as radius is half of diameter and again we are given the height of the cylindrical part which is equal to 8 centimeter. Now, volume of water in cylindrical portion is equal to, now according to our key idea, volume of a cylinder is pi r square h. And this is equal to take pi is equal to 3.14 into 1 into 1 into 8 centimeter cube and this is equal to 25.12 centimeter cube. Let us give this as number 1. Now, it is given the diameter of the spherical part is 8.5 cm. So, we have diameter of spherical portion is equal to 8.5 cm. Therefore, Radius of the spherical portion is equal to 8.5 upon 2 cm and which is equal to 4.25 cm. Now, volume of water
in spherical portion is given by the formula of 4 by 3 pi r cube and this is equal to 4 by 3 into take pi is 3.14 into 4.25 cube centimeter cube and this is equal to 4 over 3 into 3.14 into now 4.25 cube is equal to 76.765 so volume of water in spherical portion is equal to 4 by 3 into 3.14 into 76.765 centimeter cube and this is again equal to now 4 into 3.14 is 12.56 into 76.765 centimeter cube upon 3 and this is equal to 321.8 3.39 centimeter cube. Let us give this as number 2. Now, volume of water in a vessel is equal to volume of water in the cylindrical portion plus volume of water in the spherical portion. So, volume of water in the vessel is equal to volume of water in the cylindrical portion plus volume of water in the spherical portion So, by using 1 and 2, we have volume of water in the vessel is equal to 25.12 plus 321.39 centimeter cube. by using 1 and 2 and this is equal to 346.51 centimeter cube but the child finds the volume of water in the vessel to be 345 centimeter cube hence the child is incorrect because the volume of water in the vessel is 346.51 centimeter cube so volume of water to be 345 centimeter cube is incorrect hence the answer for the above question is the volume to be 345 centimeter cube is not correct Correct answer is three forty six point five one centimeter.
救。I hope the solution is clear to you. Bye. I'll take care.